Boys, girls, guys, girls, what is going on? My name is Slightly Salty, and welcome to the finale of the Pokemon um, Usum three-way cage lock. I am here with Roki only this time. Introduce yourself, man. What is going on, guys? And welcome to the final fight between myself and Slightly Salty for the Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon cage lock. Three-way cage lock. If you guys are confused on what's going on, why it's only me and Roki, well, it's because each of us are getting our own finale um, for the battle itself. Me and Roki will be doing in this, will ba be battling in my episode. In Roki's episode, it'll be him and Wes, and then in Wes's episode, it'll be him and me. That way, each of us get a final fight and just a finale itself. After each of our battles, though, it'll be the same post-match convo. So if this is your first video to watch, make sure to pause at the end of the battle after me and Roki are done, we will do a 3-2-1 countdown for spoilers and stuff. Um, but just make sure to pause, go check out the other two, and then you could stay on the one that you finished on or come back and watch this one. But that's pretty much all it is. If it's not your first time viewing, it's if, if it's your second or third, well, you guys have already seen the outcome of that. But this is the first battle getting recorded. So, we're both pumped. Roki, are you ready? Bro, I'm about as ready as I ever can be, man. I mean, the whole entire series comes to this moment right here, and it literally comes down to the teams we brought and the first Pokemon that we both send out. Exactly. This is going to be huge. Let the battle begin, man. I just hit a let's see. I'm, I'm really curious on what your team is. Let's really do curious. this, bro. Also, Wes is not in the call. That way, nobody gets an unfair advantage. Okay, so you did bring the Mimikyu. I, I thought you were going to bring it. I thought you were going to bring it. Your team's not at all what I thought it was going to be. I mean, somewhat. I see three of them that I expected. The other three I maybe... Well, I guess... No, actually, the the, the Reshiram was the only one that really is catching me off guard. But I don't blame you. Reshiram's great. Wow. This is not at all what I was expecting. It's a fun one, right? I don't even know what I want to lead. <clears throat> I don't know what I want to lead either. You brought the Nine Tails. That Nine Tails is definitely well. The Nine Tails and your Groudon are going to be your answer for his Ultra Necrozma. Yeah, that's pretty much what I have to do, bro. Like, it's going to be tough. Ooh, it's gonna be interesting gonna be to threat. see. It's gonna be interesting to see. I don't even know what I want to lead with. Do I want to set up and sweep right off the bat? It's hard to say, man. Man, your team is disgusting. Yours is as well, bro. You have that that freaking Kyogre is a threat. Ten seconds. Make sure to register everybody, eh? I'm ready. I I don't know if this was the right first lead. Good luck, my friend. Yo, I could get the dude. Do you have the I'd have the champion fight thing, so I have the United so Gamer fight for mine. <laughs> Let's go, bro. Woo! All right. Final fight time, baby. Final fight, what are you leading? You do lead with Velvet, okay. I figured. I figured. Really? Okay. Okay. I see. Yeah. You. Misty Surge. Ooh. But what you don't know is that helps me. Does it though? It does. Hmm. Question is, are you actually going to stay in here? <laughs> You still don't know my ability. Oh, I know your ability. What's my ability? Uh, let's just say it's probably a little, little gutsy. That's what you think. That's what I think. Ability capsules are a thing. Ability capsules are, in fact, a thing. Okay. But I also didn't want to risk anything. Okay, I respect that. I respect that. Gonna see the air slash come off. That's all right. Not gonna do anything. 
No, not at all. Not at all. What type is this thing? You, you. Oh wait, have no. Never one. mind. Never mind. Never mind. I know what it is. <laughs> I know what it is. It's just shiny. I know what it is. That's why, like, it threw me off because I saw the shiny and I was like, wait a minute, what is that? I've got two shinies on my team. I got two shinies on my team, and they are both massive powerhouses. They definitely are. And remember, there's no talking to the other guy about what the other person happens. Every time we go into a battle, we're completely, like, not talking about other battles. That way, um, that way nobody gets, like, any hints or anything. Oh, no. I don't have the right move on one of my Pokemon. How'd you go through That's the really Elite Four without not knowing without knowing that? No, I did. It's just I made a backup of them and because I had the like the mega, I just grabbed the mega from the backup. <laughs> I knew you were doing this, but I just I had like there wasn't really too much I could have done there. I figured you were gonna try to flinch me. I think I think you were faster. Probably. Probably. Probably were. Probably were. I don't think you're faster anymore because this thing isn't perked. It is not. I even forgot you had this thing. Ooh. Ooh, that's big. That's big. Does this kill, though? I hope. Not. Absolutely. Absolutely. Wow. Dude, this thing has insane attack. Like, absolutely bonkers. This thing's a ghost type, right? See? See, Poppy. Let's go into this thing. Dude, that thing looks so cool. It's huge, too, because it's a totem. That thing is sick. What is it? It's a... Uh, is it ghost? It's normal, normal ghost. Normal ghost. Hmm, interesting. Very interesting. Yeah, I made the wrong play. Nine tails? Is this water no. normal? Yeah, it is. Water normal. All right. I'm really glad I have the skies and I've got. I told you, you know Mimikyu's moveset, right? I know Mimikyu's moveset, yeah. You sure? You would not have stayed in with this thing. I definitely feel like I just forgot about this. Yep. Ow! I forgot about Woodhammer. I was like, he's definitely switching here. Nope. That was big. That was big. Yeah, it was. It was. Now what do you do? Do you sack this thing? Full send, baby. You I'm trusting my starter. Too. I'm trusting my starter. No, you had it. No, you had it. That had to have been a roll. What were you at? I'm at six, but also you realize, did you, did you know I didn't have disguise? In this game, they gave it a second ability. I didn't get What's to take it. ability? I didn't get to take advantage of it. Um, I mean, you're not, obviously you won't know anyways. Uh, you, you, there's no point hiding it. I have adaptability. So I would have just complete. That's why I shadow sneak the ground on because I would have one shot it. That is insane. Yeah, I was like, I'm not staying in because I know that shadow sneak is coming in and gonna hurt. It's gonna destroy. All right, well it's a reset now, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> I had a feeling you were going to go back out to this. I'm losing right now. Mm. 
It's close though. It's not over yet. We have we both have sweepers. Like This could go any way at any point. Ballsy. Ballsy. But I respect it. I This thing ha is fully perked out. How did I not know that? Did you? Uh, I mean, it just is. It just is. It was Wes that wrote the message. That's why. Yeah. It happens. I think you're, st I think you're still faster. Yeah. Yeah. Do I live one? Probably not. No. No. This tornado is too big damage. Dude, this song is such a bop. This is such a like sick song to listen to during the final fight. I wish we could use it. I almost want to message Dylan and see if we can use it. Um... I might just lose here. Nah, you got this, bro. I believe in you. This is my best bet. I really thought this thing was choiced. That sucks. Choice wouldn't have been bad. Choice wouldn't have been bad. Oh, I forgot this thing gets extra sensory. I sacked this. I sacked this for no reason. I completely forgot you have extra sensory. I almost considered changing it too, but I was like, nah, that's gonna be too like too good. Oh, okay, it comes out. This is the thing that I'm scared for. If you get a flinch, it's done. Mm, not quite. <laughs> Okay, you have Quiver on this thing, too. That's crazy. Yeah. That does not do as much now, though. And that does a lot. But you kill with another, I think. It's going to be a roll. I don't think it is. I think, I think it is. Kill. I think I think I messed up. I should have double covered. No. No, nah, I think it's a roll. I think you kill. I think this is game. Oh. Yo. <laughs> that was huge. I threw. I I should have gone straight into this thing instead of the uh Instead of the Nito. That's okay. Not, not knowing this thing had Quiver fucked me up. Yeah, Quiver was big on this thing. Getting that triple perk was huge. I don't really think it matters what I do. Everything matters, Salty. No, I think you just kill. I feel bad for that one. That one I actually feel bad for. I'm not going to lie. I really do. You haven't even I want you to live this. You haven't even missed one. You haven't even missed one. That is true. It is 95% accurate. I think it's 90 I think it's 95. So I think I checked it before, but GG salty. GG's. This was oh, my redemption annoying. from Sword and Shield when you pretty much swept me. That's annoying. Our first series. Guys, go back and check out the Sword and Shield cage lock that me and Salty did. Yeah, this might be a double loss. Uh, but we're gonna see you guys a second in the post match uh breakdown after we get these other two battles done. 
All right. right. So, yeah. So, so that Westy final... won? Yeah, yeah, I mean, that was pretty much a clean sweep for the most part. Um, so the things that I had, obviously, like I had, I had bulk up on Groudon that I was, you know, really hoping for. So we'll go into like kind of bouncing forth between the two. I one shot Salties, but the thing is I didn't actually one shot Salties, um, Garchomp. He had, um, what item did you have on Garchomp? Cause you had like a good chunk of damage taken <clears throat> off of you. Did you have like life orb or something? Yeah, I did. Yeah. So that's why I had like initially in my mind I thought that I was gonna one shot your Garchomp as well. Westy um, ran one item that saved him against me. He ran. Did Westy beat you as well? He ran Focus Sash Decidueye, and that's what yeah. won him the game. Uh, oh jeez, that's crazy. I needed the it because um, I could I could either Focus Sash and guarantee a free shift gear. I guess focus sash and guarantee a spectral thief. So if something's set up on me, I got a way to deal with it. Yeah. That was my thought. I mean, because I I outsped his entire team as long as they weren't set up with my Nido King. Yeah. So guys, we should probably talk about like who like won all of them, West, obviously. West won, I lost them all. I came in last. Roki, you came in second. West came in first. I oh, lost to Roki. Roki be here. I I messed up. I I threw what essentially. Moves did you forget, uh, so I had Wish on um, Megalodios instead of Recover. That was the only thing that really was a difference. Oh, Lottie, uh, Lottie didn't even touch the field on, in our game. Yeah. Like I threw at one point, but like I don't even know if it mattered at that point. Like it was just a matter of like taking down the Mon that he had on the field. I threw. Um, like it. It was just a. Uh, Roki outplayed me, to say the least. Yeah. Like I started throwing, I started clicking the wrong moves because Roki was playing really well, what? and it was just I, I mean, both. Of I your started teams off were with the tornadoes as well, same thing, and just. And let me guess, you know, he started with the Volcarona. Uh, no, no he started with Reggie Rock, which was big, really big, yeah. Because obviously that he got toxic spikes up. The thing was, is um, I the problem that that really screwed me was I had a lumberry on my Dragonite. It was huge for that. Because and I, I was able to spore. Yeah, he was able to spore me right afterwards, and I had outrage. So I was planning on doing outrage lumberry. And he's like, hey, he used Aura Beam on his rate on my Volcarona, thinking it was Ultra Necrozma. And he's like, wait, what? <laughs> he's like. <laughs> Yeah. Um, yeah, that was big unfortunate. That was big unfortunate. They I, really get you with that. I caught on quick the second I saw the spore. Um, He's like, wait, why does this thing have spore? And He's I knew. Like, oh, uh, shit. <laughs> that thing yeah, messed me up. I didn't even up. get that far. I, uh, that thing really messed me up. I had some. Well, both of you already know I didn't have Disguise Mimikyu. I had Adaptability Mimikyu. Um, and, like,. I I that, I knew that was my only way to beat West Necrozma. Um well besides the Nido King. But it had to yeah. be it had to be on a turn that you were setting up Geomancy. Yeah. I did have Ge uh, it was Geomancy stored power, by the way. I kinda figured. That's the reason I went Geomancy instead of uh shift gear. because uh, I thought about going physical because he, he was plus special or plus attack nature that's like, that's why i was going for the inferno also yeah. i i i completely mind fucked uh west um i had said that i knew west alternate cosmos ability i never knew it <laughs> and uh to find out it was flash fire <laughs> oh yeah, so, so, so i didn't i never went for a fire type move against him but my plan was going to be a fire type move with the kyogre on him and but I then there's no, he has to go an ice type move, so I was like, okay, I'm bringing Volcarona disguised as Ultra Necrozma, so that he has to hit me with ice type move on the Kyogre, right? But he would have went for a fire type move, and I'd be, I would have been like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> so no matter no, what, no. if it I didn't had... happen, but man, it would have been funny. It would have been super funny because then he would have outed himself. <laughs> yeah, but um. 
Uh, yeah, that was FYI, good, that was fun. One of my biggest changes to move sets was Kyogre. I was running a Serene Grace Kyogre. That was its initial ability that it's had all series long. Wow. And uh, I ended up switching it last second to No Guard Kyogre with hydro yeah, yeah. hydro pump inferno which is 50 percent accurate but a 100 percent guarantee to burn and initially wow. i had focus blast on it but i last second changed it to draco meteor um for the um for the necrozma he had so, a no guard mon that's crazy but that's my yeah. but like looking at the teams like like every time i got into it i'm like both of your teams are just like pretty much legends and two strong mons or megas and two strong mons and then i'm like i got mimikyu but mimikyu does not stand compared to like ghost dark decidueye yeah Ugh. and the, yeah decidueye was like my key to like stopping something if it's if it's set up on me and i can like it and it, it did come into play thanks to the that it, King. it did come into play i was sweeping with needle king i had a plus six needle king on the field that was... and you picked the most opportune time to go into it too, so I couldn't party and shut out. I was like, "Damn, I've got to let Reggie Rock go down here," and and I thought I was like, "I'm not gonna do that with Robin Hood just yet because I wanted to save it for the Kyogre." I went into Dialga and just basically sacrificed it because it didn't do anything because it just one got one shot. Yeah, uh, yeah there wasn't much know. I could do against West Team really. If I had lived. If I had lived that Spectral Thief, it would have been a different game. Because did you have any priority uh, left? No. Because Garachomp no, didn't. didn't have priority. I would have won. If yeah, I lived. I have, I and have I, no priority. I, st I still think the Spectral Thief was a roll. It probably was, honestly. Like, the only thing that... I, I honestly think that um, Garchomp would have survived the Dragon... Draco Meteor, but then it wouldn't have survived this other stuff. So, like, you would have yep. won. If, if I didn't kill you right then with Spectral Thief, you would have won. Yep. Um, yeah. Stuff like that. I, I think, um, I don't know. I think maybe if I brought the... Because initially I was actually going to bring the Gudra instead of the um, Garchomp, and I think that would have been the bigger play for me. Yeah, that would have been... Uh, honestly, really huge. I, that, I searched for hours for that Garchomp pot because I was like, I need a way to stop electric. Like, if something hits me with electric, I move. I can just Mega Evolve. Is what it was my thought. Never found it. If I didn't, I didn't really have electric. If I didn't get Mimikyu, I was actually bringing three water types because nobody had electric. I did. I had Feromosa and Buzzwall, and I almost brought Buzzwall. Oh, yeah, you had the Buzzball. I wasn't worried about the Feramosa. You didn't have perks on it, so I knew it wasn't going to come. Um, Buzzball didn't either, but it was it's just so good. Like, oh, my Buzzball God. I was, ex so I, was ex good. I was expecting all your perked up mons. Like, your team, I figured, was coming. Um, I, I really wasn't. I, I I just wasn't expecting Focus Ass to Shai Yeah, I brought three Steel Tops. Yeah. I was going to have three water. Like, uh, like I was like, man, I am bringing a lot of the same toppings but I, I feel like this is my my play oh yeah. and instead it of the works. rush instead of the reshi ram i was bringing um i was bringing my uh hydragon dragon fire reshi ram was just a better Ooh. better choice I also think. also uh, well yeah. um it had um not reshi ram the other one hydragon <clears throat> had flash fire uh, which nobody really had used fire type moves, so that wouldn't have played. But Reshiram uh, had Arena Trap. Oh, that's oh. big. That could have been big. Yeah. Oh. But yeah, that could have been huge. If you have, if imagine if you would have got the thing earlier and had perks on it, where you could set, you could bring it in against something and set up. Man, Arena Trap is so good for stuff like that. You mean like our final cage match? <laughs> Yeah, because we had one more cage match after that legend. So if I had just gotten that legend, then mm -hmm. it definitely could have been a potential. But uh, I think uh, I think then something else wouldn't have gotten perked up then. Um, 
Actually, I don't even know if my other stuff was brought. Um, I also had contemplated bringing Haxorus, which had Dazzling. Yeah, my Moltres had Dazzling, but it never came into play. Could have been good. Haxorus is great. Haxorus has got a busted attack stat. Yeah. yeah, it's really good for being just like a quote-unquote basic mon. Again, why I wanted the Garchomp hot. Base 170 attack but after it's, a shift gear. But it's insane. You have no dragon dragon ground stab. That's true. Yeah. It, it gets none. It gets none. We have no grounder dragon TMs uh, that are on the physical side, at least. I, ha I have Land's Wrath, but it can. Learn. Oh, I have Land's Wrath too, but it couldn't learn it. Exactly. Because yeah. um, if it could, I would have ran it. Mm hmm. All I wanted was one or the other. One or the other, and I was running Mega Chomp. I, I ran uh, Choppleberry. Uh, I wish I would have run Shuggaberry, looking back at it, but I, ran, I, I had to pick one, and I, I picked, picked Chopple. Uh, I just went le uh, Life Orb. I figured with the Shift Gear Life Orb, I figured that's what I needed. Um, I don't know, man. It was just, a, it, it was just so... Such a difficult thing to strategize against i kept knowing i needed power because your team was so bulky yeah yeah the, the uh the Resurrock is just kind of busted honestly <laughs> well i had no issues with it <laughs> yeah you didn't R roki went for a, a body slam with his non-tails he's like wait a minute <laughs> well it was pixelate body slam so it made sense i was but going it, for the para but yeah. not but nine tails is also a special attacker yeah it was after he used for cannon so he could and he had lost two special attack yeah that thing got gets flare cannon yeah, yeah. yeah. Bro, i was like damn he went for it it didn't touch <laughs> a f uh roki only had to i think use three mons against me uh, I, I, yeah, I, I think poorly, I used... I really poorly played against Roki. Tornadus, uh, my Raikou, and Groudon. Yep. And then I might have used a little bit of one of my other mons, but... What were your other three? Uh, Ninetales, Dragonite, and Megalodios. None of them touched the field. I... <laughs> uh, but also, what also messed me up is I I didn't realize his Tornadus was fully perked because... Yeah, I, I did post in the Discord. Yeah, because tornadoes. you posted it, not Roki. I, I didn't bother reading yours because I figured I knew your team. Uh, so that kind of yeah. messed me up, but it is what it is. I, I should have remembered from the series. Like, uh, like, there's no blaming the loss on that. Like, I saw the Quiver Dance go off, and I'm like, shit, what do I do? And uh, I brought my Kyogre in, and then I, I tried to Quiver Dance with my Kyogre. And um, I was like, wait, you've already Quiver Danced up. That was such the wrong... The Quiver Dance Kyogre screwed me up in both games. Oh, jeez. I should have attacked rather than Quiver Dancing in both games. Because um, yeah, I forgot... You would have won against me i would have uh i don't think so if you kill if if garchomp died you won i think no because i wasn't living kyogre wasn't living a hit against uh against the cross oh, no, I, did, I did have uh, the I only have way died. the only way i won <clears throat> would have been if you had um geomancy against my kyogre See, I almost, I almost brought a bulky Necrozma uh, with Geomancy, Iron Defense, Sword Power, and Recover. I would have quit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. mean, I, did, I didn't think anyone had a Dark Tide. The only thing I was worried about was uh, Robin Hood or Decidueye coming from Salty. So I, I was like, no, I can't do it. I can't do it. Oh, yeah. It's I forgot dead. it was dead. That's the whole reason I didn't bring that. That's the whole. Oh, re well. That's the whole reason I had to bring Mimikyu. Yeah. Oh wow. I had Dark I mean, Pulse on Tornadus. That was pretty much the only Dark that I had. Oh, and I also forget the genie stupidly get extra sensory. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> extra sensory <clears throat> Dark Pulse. Because yeah, extra sensory. Because well. I tried setting up with um, and I also. I also forgot that he was going to be faster because he quiver danced uh, against my Nido King. 
So I tried sending sending in the Nido King strat against the Tornadus that was already had a quiver dance up. So he one shot me with extra sensory. <laughs> I was like, right. <clears throat> These stupid yeah. things get extra sensory. Yeah, it happens. It happens. All in all, though, dude, there were some good fights. There were some good fights. Yeah. We had a lot of really good cage matches in this series. I had a ton of fun. Yeah, it was absolutely the best. We, we definitely got to keep the series going. It's going to take a little bit of a hiatus, though. Yeah. Uh, it's oh, kind yeah. of ironic, though, that, like, um, Roki washed me. West rushed Roki. But like me and West battle was down to the wire. It, it, it anything could have changed that battle. Like, like it was uh, so close. Dude, like I'm hyped crit. to see that battle. I'm hyped to see that battle. Like uh, yeah, like getting double flinched against Roki two in a row. There was a lot that I didn't get flinched on with Air Cutter, but then uh, I got double flinched in a row, and that I felt pissed bad me off. That one. That one, oh, I felt and, bad. And then after that, I think he got a crit. <laughs> yeah, I genuinely felt bad for that one. Against my Kyogre, they weren't going to miss because I had no guard. So no guard affects both Pokemon, but... True, yeah. Yeah. But either way, guys, that was a fun series. It was great. It was. It was a blast. And uh, kind of fun. in the if next one... Like cage matches, make sure you're checking out. It should be out right now. It's right? out by now. It's yeah, out. make sure you're checking out the rotation cage log with the quad squad. Oh yeah! <laughs> our Hell first yeah. our first cage match in that series should be going up tomorrow on Pancake's channel. If this goes up Monday, if this is up on the Monday, it goes up tomorrow on Pancake's channel. If it doesn't, it's going up on Tuesday. Uh if we posted this earlier, if we posted this later, it went up the Tuesday that just passed. Um but yeah, be sure to check out that series because that is a never before seen type of cage lock uh rotation cage lock our partners change every cage lock that's a lot of fun we've recorded two cage yeah. matches so far it's been a lot of fun and okay. um not going to talk about spoilers for that series but you definitely want to check wanna it out it. yeah oh yeah. yeah it's been good it's been so much fun there's some nods in that one to this series so um it, it's kind of funny to see that there's some connections between the two series even though they're completely unrelated so be sure to go check that one out uh who wants to wrap it up go for it do it man that's it for this one guys i hope you guys did enjoy all three of our episodes and as always stay salty thank you Bye. guys peace mm -hmm.